I think this is one, er one area where we can work very closely um, and privately with China on understanding the dimensions of this problem. I think in the United States, we say th that China has the most leverage on North Korea, and they do have leverage because they provide some power supplies and, and other uh, assistance. But really, they don't have the kind of leverage that they used to have with um, the current leader's father. So I think the Chinese, the Americans, certainly South Korea and Japanese need to start working together on trying to figure out what to do about North especially, Korea. But also, especially when you're dealing with a, a clearly irrational regime and irrational leader. I mean, is there, are there lessons in how to cope with that? Well, <laughs> you know, it's difficult. You want to shut down their ability to carry out their intentions. So one of the things that's being discussed now are the, the type of sanctions that we put on Iran that ultimately brought Iran to a negotiating table. Um, I'm not equating the regimes yeah, I was gonna say in those two countries. Yeah. Um, but those types of sanctions, which were much more uh, invasive than the current sanctions on North Korea, you're now, talk, you, you're now hearing um, a lot of talk about applying those types of sanctions to North Korea. Yeah.